Hi guys, this is Sati Verma. So there is an update on our hydroponic, aeroponic tower garden. Uh, if you are interested in finding out how did we make uh, this uh, tower garden, you can watch my earlier video. There is a uh, bucket filled with water and nutrients and there is a submersible pump inside that takes the water all the way up and then it rains down. And if you have seen my earlier video, we planted basil and this basil uh, uh, Tulsi it is coming really well as you can see the plant here. It's quite big in fact uh, We planted one uh, morning glory also and this morning glory seems to have taken over The entire tower with basil and another morning glory is coming from the ground there that is also trying to use this uh, tower to climb up and in fact it has taken two towers so this morning glory is really outgrowing out performing everything here but still we have all good basil leaves here uh, we can harvest if I can show you this side it would be more visible how these basils are doing in this tower garden uh, they are at six inch uh, difference we have all basil planted here and see how big the leaves are they're very good I use them uh, almost every day now in my tea coffee or even in my salad eat them like that so this tower garden is coming up. I'm showing you another tower here. Uh, this is also the same one uh, with a smaller tower. And the length of this tower is only up to this high. And we have planted peppers here. And this is doing beautiful. Uh, we have started seeing uh, peppers in this plant. They are just growing. They are in the earlier stage. See the baby, uh, baby peppers are coming up here. You can see there are many more peppers waiting to uh, be grown, uh, come up here. See many peppers coming here. So it is really, it's really going big. In fact, these plants are hanging out there. So I had to tie them up to keep them in place. It's a beautiful uh, crop of peppers coming on this tower this year. So we are very pleased with uh, whatever uh, we did with this hydro aeroponic aeroponic towers one quick uh, concern here uh, out of after three or four years this bucket is, is breaking up as we fill water it gets the pressure from the water and it uh, just uh, breaking down this bucket is no good so next time when I use uh, uh, the reservoir <coughs> so to say I will pay attention that the bucket or the reservoir I use must be from a further tougher material so that it lasts a couple more years so it is for three four years a bucket lasting me three four years like that i'm happy but still i will go uh, for another tougher material this uh, reservoir here this seems to be um, holding itself very well uh, this is also from the hardware store which i got locally so yeah um, i mean this hydroponic aeroponic so very successful crop and uh, with less efforts basically low maintenance uh, we add a nutrient solution two, three times in this bucket and then we just stopped feeding it because it was in the uh, flowering to um, fruiting stage. So at that time we stopped giving any nitrogen or any further nutrition. Just use the city water, plain water. So they are going now in plain water. Here also because we are concerned mostly in the, in the leaves. So we just uh, added initially the nitrogenous based uh, uh, fertilizer the nutrients and uh, we didn't use the blossom part of it because we are not interested in any um, uh, flowers or fruits on these basil plants we are simply concerned by the leaves and we are getting them using only nitrogen based uh, hydroponic nutrients so that's about the update probably i'll give you another update when it grows further thank you very much for watching